So combat is all about philosophy. I mean, if you don't have a philosophy here, you're not gonna get to anywhere. In every fight, there are ranges. Generally, how many ranges you think do we have? So three ranges, long range, mid range, short range. What that means long range? Before my opponent reach me, what he has to do? To get closer to me, right? It's time and physic, the space. It's all about time and the space. If he's angry and he want to hurt me or whatever, he have to walk toward me, walk toward me. Come, come on, he have to reach me. If he doesn't reach me, if he stay in the long range, he won't be able to hit me. There's no way he can hit me. So he had to get close to me, get close to me. Then you're talking about the conflict here because he can reach me. So before he reach me, I'm gonna use my long range weapon. Don't think if you are working on your hands, that means we don't know how to kick. No, we know how to kick. But we want to start with the hand because hand is more simpler. Because once you lift your leg, you're off balance. It's too risky. You might fall, he might push you. I'm here. He wanna reach me, reach me. Where I can stop him right away on his knee. This is where I stop him. I don't care what he want to do to me. I don't care what is his plan. I don't care maybe he come to me and he say, hey, you know what? Let's go and have a coffee. When I see his body language, when I see his emotion that he show me there's aggression there and I can sense my intonation, can sense that something is going wrong. You don't go like, what if, what if? There's no what if. So come on, reach me, bang, right around the knee. This section is going to break his knee. If you just give him a snap and control him, like if he goes this way, if you're just controlling, like, like See, I could just tap him here. If I go a bit higher, of course, he's not gonna get harmed because it's his, you know, it's a tie. So it's just like he's gonna get the pain a bit and he's gonna stop. And if you go to his knee, depends on how much force you put. If you put too much, you can break his knee. So we have like side kick, we have this way kick, we have with our front kicks. We use all the kicks below the hips because it's less risky. Of course, we can kick also high. Like if you're gonna get close, get close, I can kick him right around his face. But this takes a lot of training, years of training, a lot of balance, a lot of work, flexibility. But why, why, why would we want to do that if I can just go right away below here? More simple and easier for you, right? So this is one thing you have to know. In the long range, we use our kicks. It could be any types. It could be I have one opponent here and I'm fighting and I see my opponent coming from the back and boom, right away I kick him. Like I say, go knee here, here, here and face. All the way you can throw your kicks. I could be here fighting and I see my opponent coming from this way. I change my leg, then I go side kick. So it's all about ranges here. For long range, this is your long missile. Once you master this range, then we go to the next phase. 